everyone. In your syllabus, they have introduced a new correlation coefficient and this is called as the Spearman rank order correlation. It was not there in the previous syllabus and therefore I decided to decided to do a video for you guys so that you understand what it is and how to calculate it using technology. In your case, you would be using a Casio scientific calculator. The Spearman correlation coefficient is based on the ranked values for each variable rather than using the raw data. So this could be a typical examination question where the population of black bears in a particular island has been recorded every five years since 1978. So they have given you two variables. The first variable is time and the second is population as you can see there. Now the first step to calculate Spearman's rank correlation coefficient would be split the two variables and rank them. This is what I have done as you can see on the screen. For the years variable, it is already in ascending order. I just put the rank in the same order. So this is number 1, 2, 3, 4 and it goes all the way until 9. The population variable is not in the correct order and therefore I had to give it a rank based on the value. Obviously we are looking at, looking at it in ascending value so I have written here 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on till 9. All right. Once this is done then your task is very simple because the calculator is going to do the job. So now you will take your calculator, you will go to the menu and you will click on stats. You have two lists there, list 1 and list 2. I will go to list 1 and now I am going to type in the rank of years. So the order is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Now I am going to the second list as you can see there and I am going to type in the rank for the population and that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 8, 7, 6 and 9. After doing that, select regression, click on this X and there you go. So the value is 0 0.933. So this is your Spearman's rank correlation coefficient usually denoted by R S as you can see here. Now try to do it yourself and you should be able to get the same answer. Thank you for watching.